Three on your Thursday, and it is the big day at the big dance for the UB Bulls men's basketball team. That's right. They are getting ready for their matchup against Miami tonight. Now, the Bulls are a 14 seed, Miami a three seed. The team ran through a 40-minute practice on the floor yesterday afternoon. They're hoping to pull off one of the biggest upsets of this NCAA tournament. That's right. 7 Eyewitness News sports reporter and sports anchor Sean Stepner joins us live from Providence with what we can expect. Hey guys, well, you know, today is really like a national holiday for sports fans really all across the country, but for UB fans in particular, it's that and then some. Yeah, the start of the NCAA tournament, you mentioned it. UB, a 14 seed in the South region here in Providence, taking on Miami, who is a three seed. That means the UB Bulls are a heavy underdog tonight. Not many picking them to win. Their opponent, Miami, one of the best teams in the country, ranked 11th over all in the nation. Bulls head coach Nate Oates knows what his team is up against this evening while guard Blake Hamilton has a plan for when game time arrives later tonight. We got to enjoy the moment, but uh, at the end of the day, we got to come out there and, you know, just play like it's a regular game. You know, you can't put too much pressure on yourself. And they're not just big, they're athletic. I mean, you, you, you watch some of the personnel highlights, it looks like a looks like an NBA highlight film on some of these guys. So they're long, they're athletic, but We've been shooting the ball well. You know, we'll, uh, if we can continue to shoot the ball well, I think we got a shot at this thing. Yeah, that might be UB's only chance tonight if they get hot, especially from beyond the arc, from shooting from the land of the three-pointer. That might be the great equalizer against the heavily favored Miami Hurricanes tonight. Tip time from the Dunkin' Donuts Center is 6.50 p.m., and we're going to have you covered all throughout the day here in Providence. For now, live in Providence, Sean Stepner, 7 Eyewitness News.